What's up YouTubers, today I'm here to show you my Doomsday Kills video. I very recently upgraded him to Elite Level 7, Level 50, and I promoted my Bone Spikes to Level 9. Let's take a look at the gear cards. I have almost 15% chance of self-heal on Special 1, and almost 25% chance of unblockable attacks with a 69% damage boost to my basic attacks. This is the same again, 70% damage boost, 45% crit chance, and that's all he gets. And again, 70% damage boost and 45% crit chance. That's a 90% crit chance on basic attacks and almost 25% chance of unblockable attacks. Doomsday has a different swipe combo than most where he only deals two punches. Uh, the thing is though, those two punches deal more damage than most two punches. So let's take a look at what he can do with those unblockable attacks and super boost damage. Begin. <laughs> Now the thing when you're fighting Doomsday who's dealing 17,000 damage with two punches is I fought this type of opponent before, this caliber, and the thing is it's scary and look how much life he gains when he knocks you out 38,000 life with doing no special moves. So when you're watching your life go down this fast it's actually terrifying and you're like what the hell is going on and how can I tag out or stop this. So, as I fought this opponent before, I got a large sum of money and I bought some Doomsdays and I haven't regretted it since. As you can see, I'm knocking my opponents down like bowling pins. And especially with Shazam, I noticed he's got a bit of a swipe combo going on that Shazam, his face seems to line up with Doomsday's fists every single time. And when you're doing seven online battles in a row you seem to run into Shazam a lot especially when I'm using Killer Frosts because they have such high life Shazam has such high life that the computer just always seems to match us up together along with Darkseid Shazam, Superman, all characters that this little swipe combo works very well on there's a clever way to get rid of Raven too I'll see you later that's nice. So I was very impressed with my purchase of Doomsday, and really he's a one-man wrecking crew I don't even really ever use. The other Killer Frost, I just use that to dampen their life and power generation. They're all kind of there just to support Begin. Doomsday. He has a gear cut score of 298. And he's no worse off for it. See how Shazam's face just always ends up lining up right where Doomsday's fist is going? That's lovely. Well, these fights I wanted to put in in their entirety because I just wanted you to see sometimes that you can't always keep punching and punching and punching without flaw. Sometimes you have to start again or... It's nice to see these two giants battle it out. See, sometimes you have to keep punching and you'll get him eventually. Just watch out for those special moves. I also wanted to make a quick note that two weeks ago I had 65 subscribers and 9,400 views. And today I have 114 subscribers and 19,000 views. So I'd like to give a big thanks to all of you for giving me 10,000 views in two weeks. It might not seem like a lot to some, but it's more than I've ever had. So my hat's off to you all for watching this video. And many more like it. So I wanted to put in a lot of fights to kind of aptly demonstrate how well this works with Doomsday. It wasn't just a one-off fluke. And basically, yeah, his arms are swinging so wide out in front that because they're so long that they're walking into his fists before they can punch. I mean, his arms must be twice as long as Joker's there. And I think it's fitting this combo works so well on Superman. Because who else should be killing Superman other than Doomsday? Too bad there's no damage text on this, but usually the first punch does 7,000 damage and the second punch does 10,000. So it's 
17,000 in two strikes, which is more than some of their characters get in three. Really, the major thing I think is when you, you're fighting someone, or when someone's fighting you, and you're watching your life go down that fast in about eight punches, it's gone. You're like, wow, this is a definite problem, and instill some panic and fear in your enemies, which is what you really want to do. You know, that's how to truly defeat your opponent is to capture their heart and crush it. Feel free to subscribe to this channel if you want to see more hard-hitting, action-packed, jaw-dropping videos like this one. You can also check out my Facebook page and Injustice Videos just for fun. Just type in Injustice Videos on Facebook, it'll come up. I also want to give a quick shout out to my friend and yours, Injustice Expert 7, who's got a channel just starting up and he'd like some support. I think we should all send him some views and give him some watches. He's also got a Facebook page that's Injustice Expert 7. Same title, search on Facebook, it'll come up just like that. These are all things to watch out for when you're swiping like crazy. Definitely watch out for that. Just your third, or his first special move charged up. Oh, here's some random fun with Killer Frost. Look at how lower life is, and then I'll execute my third special move for a complete damage overkill. So, thanks for watching, and stay tuned for my next video.